love bugs. Ooh, ooh, it's freaking spring. Welcome back to my YouTube channel. If you're new here, I'm Sarah and I help teach people to find inner happiness through fitness and spirituality. And today, we're going to change your life using this one small hack, if you will. And that is celebrating every small win that you have. And I'm not talking about the things that we typically celebrate, like job promotions, or getting married, or buying a house, or having a baby, but the everyday little things that we tend to not even think about as wins. yourself. Who were you 10 years ago? Five years ago? One year ago? I bet if you truly looked at yourself, you are not the exact person you were even one year ago. I know I'm not. One year ago, I feel like was 10 years ago. I feel like even the majority of my own closest friends don't even really know who I am anymore. Because one year ago, I hadn't even started, nor did I even know <laughs> what a spiritual awakening even was, let alone the dramatic changes it has brought to my life. And even if you aren't going through a spiritual awakening, I bet if you looked back at yourself one year ago at the little things, your small wins, you're a completely different person too. And so one example that comes to mind for me just happened a few short weeks ago. So I was getting ready to go onto a film set. Typically in the past, this would come with a lot of preparation. And I'm not talking about just learning my lines, but I would be dieting super strict. I would be doing two a days at the gym for two, three, four weeks. And overall, I would just be hardcore stressing about what my appearance would be on camera. And while this past time, I was definitely mindful of those things. I actually had a bowl of ice cream with sprinkles and whipped cream and chocolate chips just the night before going on set. Now, to many of you watching, that may seem a little bit silly to celebrate, or maybe something that you wouldn't even think to celebrate, or something that to you isn't a big deal whatsoever. But for me, it was huge! And because we all have different life paths, we all walk life differently, we all have different experiences and motives and thoughts and feelings, one person's win isn't gonna look like another person's win. And that's the beauty of life, and that's the beauty of us all being uniquely ourselves. Limitlessly ourselves. But this teeny decision of having this bowl of ice cream and not feeling guilty about it later was a huge win and a drastic change for past Sarah. And past Sarah, along with future Sarah, would also say, go ahead and hit that like button for me. Thank you. <laughs> now, would I have done that if it were a bikini shoot the next day? Probably not but that's also okay. The point is, is I took that moment to be proud of myself, to not be so hard on myself, to not feel the guilt, to not put myself under so much pressure of this perfectionism that so many of us fall into. Something that I wouldn't have done for the last 10 years, I changed. And that's why it was a win for me. So let me ask you, when was the last time you were proud of yourself for something small? Let me know in the comments below. Have you recently gone through a breakup and were on your little computer or on your phone and about to stalk your ex's social media but the last second decided not to? When? Were you doubting yourself about a possible life change, but then redirected your thoughts to a positive one? When? <laughs> Did you 
skip a workout. And instead of beating yourself up about it and guilting yourself up about it, did you just let it go? Tell yourself it was fine? Win! <laughs> Do you see where I'm getting at? These small wins snowball over time. They retrain and rewire your brain to be more kind, positive, and loving to yourself. And what does that do? It encourages you to continue celebrating your wins, to continue giving yourself self-love and positivity, and it encourages you to continue to celebrate and make those small, positive changes. It boosts self-love. It lessens self-doubt. It builds confidence. It relieves stress and pressure. It's confirming to yourself that you are enough, that you are loved. And even when it feels like your life isn't moving forward, when you feel stagnant or lost or confused, it proves to you that that's not true. When you celebrate these small wins and recognize the positive changes in yourself, it doesn't feel so bad. Did you subscribe to this channel? Win! <laughs> Did you get a load of laundry done that you weren't expecting to? Win! Did you give yourself a mental health day without guilting yourself about it? Win! <laughs> Do you see what I'm getting at here, guys? Celebrate the little things. Recognize yourself for every little thing you do. Start validating yourself. Because then, you don't need it from the exterior. You don't need validation from other people, your peers, your parents, your significant other. It doesn't matter. Because you're giving that self-love and that celebration to yourself. You don't need others to make you feel worthy because you know you already are. I want you to think about your past week, past three days, four days, whatever. What was a little win that you had? A little thought change, a little task. What was it that you did that should be celebrated as a little win that you didn't do? Let me know in the comments below. I love you guys so much. I seriously think that this small thing has been a huge life changer for me. And I just wanted to share it with you guys because we all deserve a freaking win. We all deserve to recognize ourselves for the little things that we do every day to, to grow and to be better and to be more positive. Even if you're having the most depressed day, and you're laying in bed and you don't wanna to talk to anyone, you don't wanna get up, but you showered. That can be a win. Anything can be a win. Just start celebrating yourself. Start loving yourself. I love you guys so much. I hope you really enjoyed this video. Please, please share it if you think it could help someone else or if you feel that you have someone in your life that needs to celebrate themselves more. I love you. Don't forget to like and subscribe to this video. Even the bird is saying so. <laughs> and don't forget, be limitlessly yourself.